Hello everybody and welcome to Storytime. Today we have a special story called Dragons Love Tacos. Now I have a feeling this story is going to be about dragons and there's something they love to eat. What do you think those might be? Before we get started, we're going to do our author and our illustrator song. Author, author, what do you do? An author writes the words for you. Illustrator, illustrator, what do you do? An illustrator draws the pictures for you. So let's see who the author and the illustrator are in our story. Our author, who writes all the words, is Adam Rubin. And our illustrator, who drew all the pictures, is Daniel Salmeri. Let's read our story and see what happens. I see lots of tacos on the inside. Ooh. Dragons love tacos. It says, hey kid, did you know that dragons love tacos? They love beef tacos and chicken tacos. They love really big gigantic tacos and tiny little baby tacos as well. Why do dragons love tacos? Maybe it's the smell from the sizzling pan. Maybe it's the crunch of the crispy tortilla. Maybe it's a secret. I wonder why they like tacos. Do you like tacos? What's your favorite kind of taco? Either way, if you want to make friends with dragons, tacos are key. Hey dragon! Why do you guys love tacos so much? What do you think? Why do dragons love tacos? But wait! As much as dragons love tacos, they hate spicy salsa even more. They hate spicy green salsa and spicy red salsa. They hate spicy chunky salsa and, si and spicy smooth salsa. If the salsa is spicy at all, dragons can't stand it. So he has a little book here that says, No Spicy Salsa, A Guide to Dragon Cuisine. That means dragon food. Do you think they'd like that big bowl of red salsa? Something tells me they won't like it. Why do dragons hate spicy salsa? Well, just one drop of hot sauce makes dragons' ears smoke. Do you see the smoke coming out of the dragon's ears? Just one single speck of hot pepper makes dragons snort sparks. Spicy salsa gives dragon the tummy troubles. But when dragons get their tummy troubles, oh boy. If you want to make tacos for dragons, keep the toppings mild. That means keep them nice and simple. Tomatoes, lettuce, cheese. Those are all good toppings for tacos for dragons. Look at this picture. What do you think happened in this picture? Hmm, I wonder what happened. Hey dragon, how do you feel about spicy taco toppings? Doesn't look like he feels too good about them. Dragons love parties. They like costume parties and pool parties. They like big gigantic parties with accordions and tiny little parties with charades. Why do dragons love parties? Maybe it's the conversation. Maybe it's the dancing. Maybe it's the comforting sound of a good friend's laughter. Dragons certainly love parties. What's your favorite kind of party? If 
The only thing dragons love more than parties or tacos is a taco party. Taco parties are parties with lots of tacos. If you want to have some dragons over for a taco party, you'll need buckets of tacos, pant loads of tacos. And the best way to judge is to get a boat and fill a whole boat with tacos. That's about how many tacos dragons need for a taco party. After all, dragons love tacos. That's a lot of tacos for that taco party. Hey dragon, are you excited for the big taco party? Looks like he's very excited. He even has taco on his calendar. Very excited. Just remember, dragons hate spicy salsa. Before you host your taco party with dragons, get rid of all the spicy salsa. In fact, bury the spicy salsa in the backyard so the dragons cannot find it. So it looks like all the dragons are coming over for the taco party and the house is filled with tacos. And then the little boy in the back is burying the salsa to make sure they cannot find it. These dragons love your taco party. They love the music, they love the decorations, they especially love the tacos. Congratulations. That looks like a really fun party. Looks like they're having a lot of fun with all those tacos. It's a good thing you got rid of that spicy. Wait a second. What are those little green things in the salsa? You didn't read the fine print. Totally mild salsa. Now with spicy jalapeno peppers. <gasps> jalapeno peppers are very, very spicy. Oh no. Dragons, listen to me. Don't eat those tacos. Those little green specks in the salsa, they're jalapeno peppers. They're super spicy. I know you love tacos, dragons, but you are not gonna love those tacos. Do not let the dragons eat those tacos. But it was too late. Crunch, 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 crunch. What do you think is going to happen when those dragons eat all of those tacos? I don't know. I don't know. Let's turn the page and see. Oh my goodness. Looks like they all have fire coming out of their mouths. Those must have been some really hot salsa. And the poor house got burned from all of them eating their salsa. Why would dragons help you rebuild your house? Maybe they're good Samaritans. Maybe they feel bad for wrecking it. Maybe they're just in need of a taco break. Well, that was nice of them to help rebuild the house after they burnt it down. After all, dragons love tacos. This is one of my favorite stories because I love dragons and I also love tacos. What is your favorite kind of taco and what would you like to eat if you could have a taco party? Thank you guys so much for joining me for story time and I cannot wait to see you again soon.